Here in uh, North Texas, the weather is uh, 100 degrees every day. So I uh, just want to show you my garden here a little bit and how it's doing. Ooh. If I back up here a little bit, um, a lot of it is green from uh, irrigation. But yeah, it, it's uh, the 10 foot tall tomato plants. Have some basil at the bottom there. Have some weeds at the bottom that I need to get in there and clean up a bit. So my Fresno pepper at the bottom. So my husky cherry tomato. Uh, this was originally a very very short tomato plant, but uh, it's gone kind of tall. Have some sun golds mixed in there. Some more large cherries. So my mammoth Russian sunflowers. Uh, they died a while ago, but you know I'm just keeping them there for the shade, and they look pretty nice right there. Uh, here's the okra on the back side of the garden here. Uh, some really old Swiss chard. I'm surprised that thing is still alive in the heat, but uh, the okra does love the heat, so the okra is doing really well. Over here I have a homely homer tomato. It's a heirloom. Very ugly type of tomato. I have some more tomato plants overgrown here. Uh, let's come around. So uh, have some lettuce, some baby bib that uh, went into seed. Just kind of leaving it there. Uh, here's kind of a failed experiment. You know, I'm a second year gardener, so what I did here is I topped the mammoth Russian sunflower, thinking that it would maybe get a little taller and split into two, but yeah, that didn't work out that way. So that's fine, I mean, you know, it's part of gardening, I guess. Experiments here and there. The rest of these, though, did pretty well. It's the back side of the garden here. It's my tall trellis. Some corn. I uh, made a lot of mistakes with the corn. You're supposed to, I guess, plant it in blocks so that you can fertilize it better. Uh, the corn ended up looking a little, I guess what somebody said, retarded because it was missing teeth and stuff. So, yeah. Here's some uh, cucamelons over here. Uh, they're not doing that great. They're not growing as fast as I thought they would, so I'm just kind of leaving them there, seeing what they do. And then um, I planted some spaghetti squash. Uh, these were some straggler tomatoes, so I just decided to trellis them against this trellis here. Ooh. So yeah, that's my first um, garden bed. I'm a second year gardener. Anyways, thanks for watching.